Ciao, have you heard the story, The Merchant of Venice? No? Well, let's begin. Welcome to Venice. Ah, I see you have found my gondola. I am a gondolier. What is that, you ask? Well, that is somebody who steers the gondola. We have been doing this a job for hundreds of years, and we have many stories to tell, including the story, The Merchant of Venice. You might have heard of uh, William Shakespeare? Of course you have. Well, he told uh, this uh, story, and we're going to learn more about this Venetian story here in Venice. And the story begins here in Rialto. You've heard of uh, Rialto, I presume? Well, Rialto is the marketplace of Venice. A marketplace is a place where people come to trade, to exchange money for goods, for example, uh, the fish, uh, the tin tuna. Hey, we don't have the tin tuna here in the 15th century. Of course, this story, The Merchant of Venice, is set in the 15th century. And in the 15th century, we don't have uh, tin the tuna. Anyway, everybody come here to trade with the ship, with the boat, a lot of money, everybody is happy in Rialto. Well, almost everybody. Well, actually, in the story, the merchant of Venice, in Rialto, that man there is a never happy. I say, good morning, how are you? And he does not care, he never smiles. Well, that man there is the money lender. What is a money lender? Well, it is somebody who lends money. Ah, it makes perfect sense. Money lender lends the money. He gives you the money and later you give the money back. But he always wants a more money. And now I need to tell you about the merchant in this story. A merchant is a person who trades a lot of things to make uh, the money. And the merchant uh, borrowed the money from the money lender. It's a bad idea. What is the difference between a lend and a borrow? Well, lend is when you give the money and later you get it back. If you borrow, you take the money and later you give it back. So the merchant borrowed the money from the money lender. Why? Well, his friend was in love and needed his help. Ah, Venice, the city of love. And now this is when the story gets a little bit crazy. The merchant has lost his ships and he cannot pay back the money lender. Now that means he cannot return the money. The money lender is a very mean. That means he is not nice at all. And also he's not generous with the money. The merchant is in big trouble. In fact, I've got to go and help the merchant. You can find out what happens by reading the rest of the book and try writing an example sentence in the comments. Ciao!